What's happening, friends? All right, I'm going to give you a little drum hack tip here, a little pro tip for you drummers out there. Some of y'all might know this, but a lot of you may not still, so this is for you guys. Um, so anyways, I'm in a situation now where I need a pair of mallets. I had one. I, only, I can only find one of them. I don't know what happened to the other one. I might have left it at a, at a rehearsal spot or something, and I got taxed or whatever. Um, but I need a pair. I got a couple of Christmas Eve concerts coming up this weekend, and I need a pair of mallets. So instead of jumping on Amazon and spending 25 bucks on a new pair of mallets, I thought I would make my own. And all you need to do this, pack of cymbal felts. I went out last night by myself. Pack of cymbal felts for $7.25. And an extra pair of sticks. And all you need to do is this. You can already see where this is going. But all I'm going to do is take one of these cymbal felts, boom, slide that right on there. And presto, mallet. Now you might see this as cheap. I don't see it as cheap. I see it as actually really smart because it's almost exactly the same thing at the end of the day. So if you have an extra pair of sticks lying around, just go out, spend a few bucks on a pack of cymbal felts and make your own. These things will be every bit as durable and will last you just as long as any pair that, um, that you buy in the store. And they'll sound exactly the same, they'll perform exactly the same, and there you go. So a couple of tips for doing this. Number one, the hole in these cymbal felts, it's the size of that hole there. This is the perfect size hole to fit snugly onto a 5B stick. So if you've got a 7A or a 5A, they will be on, they'll definitely be loose on a 7A. 5A, it'll, it'll slide on there. 5B, for sure, it'll fit nice and snug. The other thing I recommend is that, you know, just get some glue, some carpenter's glue or whatever, put it on the end there, um, and slide that on, and just let it set. If you need a pair in a pinch, this will work if you're just doing some cymbal work or whatever, but if you plan to use it on the toms, this will eventually come loose and might go flying on you. So, you know, just make sure you glue that down and let it set. But uh, yeah, other than that, man, boom, pair of mallets. The other cool thing about these, of course, is that it's reversible, right? So you have a stick on one end and a mallet on the other, so you get double the function. So not bad, right? For a couple of bucks, you end up with a nice pair of mallets that will sound just like any pair of mallets that you can get in the store. So there you have it, man. Wicked pro tip. Wicked, Wicked pro, pro fish. Fish.